But why, um, all I can really say about her that hits me instantly is this warmth that she had. And when people met her, they felt right at home. And uh, she always went out of her way and was very, uh, the, the big word is talkative and uh, understanding. And I just loved her as a, a cousin and a fellow human being. Right, the, uh, I'm a past president of the Lebanese Canadian Society of British Columbia, and my cousin Vi Smith was also a past president. She was a wonderful person. She was actually born on February the 14th, St. Valentine's Day, and you know, that's all about love and uh, sharing your feelings with uh, your friends and family. And she had that wonderful, radiant, personality when she met people made them feel as if they've been longtime friends and uh, she just had a, a wonderful way about her and uh, and I found her to be so uh, dynamic in her personality and Nick she uh, was a great uh, believer in her ancestry she made actually two trips to Lebanon one as a young person then later on with her husband in her senior years. And she always encouraged people, you gotta make that trip to Lebanon and see the, what, 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 Berdalne, what is that in Arabic? Berdalne, yeah. yeah. <laughs> As a lot of you know, the uh, society actually started in 1911, uh, coming from Lebanon. And uh, here, when you consider 1911 and our 2016 right now, that's over 100 years. Oh, uh, Vi's mother is right here at the Annie, mm -hmm. and that's her father there, mm -hmm. Tufik, uh, Shumez, and uh, my sister is right here, Eleanor. And the, uh, but these are all, probably 80% of them are related to each other. Mm -hmm. Now speaking about the uh, benches, that we have in Queen Elizabeth Park in Vancouver. I think it would be very nice uh, honoring uh, Michael, your dear mother, Vi Smith, and uh, if a bench was established there in memory of her. And I still remember the wonderful words that when uh, uh, Nick, you found out that she had passed away, that uh, in describing her and what she was representing and stood for that uh, I can still remember your last few words of your sentence saying that may her memory live on eternally and uh, I would hope that uh, something along a, a, a bench sharing with other dear Lebanese people that have gone on before her uh, would be a, a recognition very worthwhile and for generations to come can remember the respect that we had for one each other as uh, Lebanese Canadians. <laughs>